everyone. In this video, I will be showing you how to do the mirror and chrome effect using Mia's Secret products. I will be doing this on my own acrylic nails. To start off, we are going to do a base coat on the nail. Make sure you prep and prime your nail as usual. I have already done so. So I'm going to start off with the base coat. After applying one coat of the base, remember that you do have to cure it in an LED or a UV lamp since it is a gel polish. Once nails have been cured, they will be left with a tacky residue on them. Make sure to wipe them clean with some type of cleaning solution. To start the mirror effect, polish on a thin layer and let it dry. After it has completely dried, you can add another thin layer and if you need to clean up your cuticle area, go ahead and do so. I'm using Poochie's Nails Cleanup Brush with some acetone to clean around the cuticle area. As it starts to dry, you can see the mirror effect shine through. And once it's completely dry, you can see the mirror effect. Do keep in mind that this type of effect will only last a couple of hours. Moving on to the chrome mirror effect, what you need to do is follow the same steps you did as the mirror effect, only now we will file the sides of the nail and the top of the nail. Filing the sides and the top will ensure a proper seal once you add the top coat. Once done, make sure you wipe off excess dust. And now you're ready to do the top coat. Make sure you seal your edges and the top of your nail with the UV top coat. Clean your edges and cure under a UV or LED light. Once cured, remember you will still have a sticky layer on top, so make sure to wipe that off with cleaning solution or finish solution. 